Windows 11's file explorer is slow. Microsoft is also aware of it, so they're fixing it by preloading it on startup. Basically, when you turn on your computer, the file explorer will run on startup in background. It will be ready to launch and it will feel faster. And obviously, it will cause system to use more resources. So in this video, I'm going to try out the new faster Windows 11 file explorer and give my opinion on what Microsoft can do to fix the slow file explorer in Windows 11. But first, check this out. Uh, someone tested the new faster file explorer, the preloaded one, and <laughs> on their test, even after preloading the file explorer in Windows 11, it's slower than Windows 10. Yeah, they did a lot of testing here. If you preload the file explorer, it will use more system resources, almost double amount of system resources, okay? And they have done a comparison here before and after. So yeah, it feels a little bit faster. Okay, you can see here. And here is the funniest part. <laughs> Windows 11 File Explorer versus Windows 10. This one. Windows 10's File Explorer is just faster. A lot faster. Okay. So now let's do our own test. I don't have Windows 10 to test, but I can compare the regular File Explorer versus the preloaded one. So in this Windows 11, we have normal File Explorer. Let's launch it. Yeah, that takes a lot of time, maybe for the first time. Yeah, yeah, still like you can see this is the normal file explorer. Now let's check out the faster file explorer. Okay, it's preloaded. How you know it's preloaded? You can go to task manager and uh, type X Explorer, and you can see it's running in the background, even though I have not launched it. Okay, it's preloaded basically. Now let's open the preloaded one, the faster one. Yeah, you can clearly see the difference. It's a lot faster. You know what? We can make this even faster, even without the preloading. Okay. You know, by default, Windows 11's file explorer opens in home, which makes loading things inside slower. You can see file explorer launches fine pretty fast, but inside it takes time. To fix that, we can go to uh, three dot menu and then option and then change this option. Open File Explorer 2 from home to this PC. Apply, hit OK. Now, if we close that and open it again, yeah, it's a lot faster. Now, if we do the same thing on the regular Windows 11 File Explorer, yeah, it will launch slightly faster. So let's also change this file explorer to open to this PC. Okay, I'm gonna apply. Okay, now, yeah, you can see it's, it's, it's faster, a lot faster, almost as fast as the preloaded file explorer. So basically, if you change this simple thing, you can make this thing feel much faster, not just feel it, it actually opens much faster uh, with preloaded almost the same I really can't tell the difference <laughs> okay the only thing is that it's using more system resources okay if I go file explorer you can see it's using 107 megabytes okay the preloaded one now let's check on the regular one by opening the file explorer actually oh it's using the almost the same even on non-preloaded file explorer okay because it's opened actually opened okay now on preloaded file explorer if we close it it's still gonna use system resources okay so yeah you can see it's still using 100 plus megabytes at least on my system okay so yeah, it's gonna constantly run in background and yeah, maybe it feels a little bit faster. Once you change the this setting, open file explorer to this PC, it actually feels a lot faster. Okay, even without the preload. I can't really tell the difference. Okay, <laughs> it's already fast. But if we change this to home, even with the preload, it will feel slow. Yeah, you can see here. Oh, open, come on. Yeah, you can see. 
there is a huge delay. So even the preload can't fix the Windows File Explorer. Yeah, okay, just change the Open File Explorer to this PC and yeah, you'll be good to go even without the preloads. Okay, that's the best thing you can do to make Windows 11 File Explorer faster. Preloading Windows File Explorer doesn't make it that much faster. I can just change this simple option. Okay, if you really want to make the Windows 11 File Explorer faster. Now, here is the thing. I have that done on my actual PC. Yeah, this opens to this PC. No preloads, no nothing. It feels much faster. If you're a Windows 10 user, yeah, if you compare this, side by side, even with the preload, Windows 10's File Explorer will be faster. And I think the reason why Windows 11's File Explorer feels slow is because there are two types of coding done in it, okay, or UI used in it, okay? So Windows 11's File Explorer feels modern, but it's not fully modern. Like, for example, if I right click and go to properties, you can see it loses the dark theme and this is a old Win32 UI. And the actual Windows 11 File Explorer is written in uh, Win UI. Since the Windows 11's File Explorer is using mixed, you know, UIs in different parts, it's not consistent and that makes Windows 11 File Explorer feel slow. But you can make it a little bit faster, actually a lot faster, by changing just this thing. Okay, you don't need the preloading. Okay, just open File Explorer to this PC. By default, it will be on home. Just change this to this PC and trust me, it will make your Windows 11 File Explorer faster, a lot faster. Right now, I actually don't see a significant difference in preloading. Right now this feature is available in Windows Insider dev channel, the testing builds. So in future, this feature might come to the stable release of Windows 11. Maybe by that time we'll see some differences, but I doubt. <laughs> okay. But the good thing is that you can turn this off. You have to go to three dot menu and in File Explorer and option and then view and in here oh it's a beta channel okay it's there is no preloading view here you'll see a new option enable window preloading for faster launch times okay so you can simply disable it by unchecking it and apply now it won't run on startup maybe there is like one millisecond difference when you preload but I don't think that matters that much. And I don't think preloading apps in Windows 11 makes it faster. No, it's just going to consume more resources. And yeah, that's it for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or have any thoughts on this, you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too. Yeah, that's it. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.